Good morning guys and welcome back. Okay, it's Good Friday today and I'm in Tawan. We're going to have a little walk around the market. A um, little walk through Tawan itself. I'll look at the uh, fairground, some new rides going on and uh, we'll see where we end up. Uh, just before we head into the market, just a couple of shout outs to do. Um, first one is... I'm getting cold there. Yeah, first one is to uh, Ocean Bridge Steve. Thanks very much for your um, buy me a coffee, which you use the link on the channel for. Uh, really appreciate that. I'll, uh, I'll definitely get myself a coffee with that. Um, second shout out is to um, Paul. He's, uh, he's on the channel, Nature and Places Throughout Times. Not been too well lately. Um, I wish you all the best, uh, Paul. Um, you've got to get your videos going again. Do miss your uploads. Uh, great little channel going there. So yeah, all the best, uh, Paul. And I hope you have a happy Easter, both of you. So the fairground's just about getting set up for the day, I think. Opens in about 15 minutes. Yeah, looks like there's a few, a few new rides this year. The big wheel's gone. But there is. That is a swing. Just about 100 foot, maybe more, 150 feet. And it's got swings. Looks really good. I went past it last night when it was dark on the way home from work. All lit up. Yeah, it looked really cool. I think that was there last year. So the market itself, it's open uh, all over Easter. Good Friday today. It's open Saturday, Sunday, Monday as well. Uh, you've got all this parking, which is £3 per car. And it goes right back there. There's, there's plenty of parking. That's for the day as well, so you can park here. And... Uh, Go and have a little walk around town when you're done on the market. If you've seen the blue sunglasses that I wear usually, these are the ones on my car. This is where I got them from last year. Polarised, Foster Grants, they're brilliant. I use them every day for work. They've been to Tenerife with me. They've been to Mallorca with me. Yeah, they're really good. If uh, you've been to this market before, you'll know. You can get anything on here. A lot of the stalls now do take cards as well, which is handy. It's all your pillows. Five pound a pair. Pretty decent pillows them as well, we've had them for the caravan in the past. Oh, five pound a pair, yeah, can't go wrong can you? You've got all your usual socks, school uniforms there. So it's about 10.30 in the morning at the moment, usually when I do the filming around the markets, I get here early because come the afternoon, it's absolutely round and trying to film it's just impossible really you don't want to be looking at the back of people's heads all the way around so get here early So the sun's been in and out all morning, about half an hour ago it absolutely poured down. Just feel a little bit of drizzle now as well. Water jugging, three filter, three quid. Bargain. Oh, wow, that'll be me about every night. Oh, you mystical stuff. Now, today, obviously, I said before, it's Good Friday. Controversial, where do you stand with eating meat on Good Friday? I was always brought up to never eat meat and I still don't to be honest. Um, so where do you stand on that? Let me know in the comments, I'd love to know. And your little 
bits of jewellery. Three quid for a big umbrella. Sweets, sugar to lose. Anything not obligated to buy, even if you want to spray yourself and make yourself smell nice, it's fine. How you doing, mate? You want to try any free samples here? No obligation to buy anything, but you can try it out. What have you got here? There's all the men's here, yeah? Yeah, here you go, mate. You want to try a bit of anything? Try a bit there, try some of that. I'll have a go with that. Are, the, uh, are yeah. these the um, copies of the... No, they're not copies, just mate. All own... this is proper from British Airways. That's nice, though, actually. Away. We've got all our trading standard information in. All Perfect. The and everything. None of it's copy, none of it's fake. Completely it's, it's nice, that, actually. It's quite nice, that, mate. It I'll is tell nice. You what, we do that. We do that with the uh, Moss Brown, this is. Mold Brown. Give me names right. We do this one in. Oh, drop that one. That's a Crown Jewel one there, mate. That's, a, that's my favourite one. I'll tell you on what, that one. we put this one in. And then, just add it on, we throw that in, all that there mate, 10 quid. That's brilliant that isn't it, 10 That's quid it. guys, 10 there quid, you go. Mate. I'm sure my uh, viewers will uh, be down in the yeah, hordes, come and take this off. You're here all weekend are you? We're here all weekend and bank holiday Monday as well. All of it, we're just trying to get rid of the stock because we've got another warehouse we need to get yeah. to and get loads more, so this has got to go, we're virtually giving it away. Are you here throughout the season or is it just for the here Easter? throughout the season, yeah. yeah. We, we do loads of stops in uh, Liverpool, Aston. Yeah. Canuck all the way. I mean, he used to do uh, things in Spain or Mallorca and all that. Well, and he, he's back down here now, and I'm just his nephew, just trying to make me box. As right, well. as you do, as you do. Yeah, you know what I mean. So, well, I wish you luck with it. Um, and I'll, my viewers, will, I'm sure they'll uh, come and Brilliant. see you. Yep, come down, come down any time, any day. Perfect. Nice, nice one, mate. Some in the pub. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> that's nice, yeah, that. Really nice. Right, Cheers. See you later. Yeah, nice guy there. Yeah, get yourself down. Bargain, nice. Just three or four bottles of uh, aftershave. It smells really nice. If the skins come off my hand by the time I go off the marks, I'll let you know. <laughs> I'm sure it won't. So we get down more to the car boot side of it now. Aladdin's cave. All kinds of men. Years ago. These are all your old vinyls. DVDs, got a loft full of DVDs, and videos actually, VHS videos. So good. What's he got here? Good to throw on your work top. I do like all these signs.
you're liking the video so far guys hit the uh, thumbs up for me it really does help the channel out subscribe if you're not already plenty more of this stuff coming up on the channel so here we are here at Tear Prince um, Mark it's also a race race track to do the um, what would you call it like cart racing horse and cart type thing they have race nights on been here for many years and that's how far the market goes it continues on round that way goes right the way round right round to the other side there there's more car boot right on the other side which we'll uh, venture around to now Slippers, more slippers. This uh, ladies' boots, Crocs, Croc Locker likes. Yeah, so most of the stalls you see on here at the moment, these will be here all the way through the season. It uh, takes you up to about the beginning of November. It is, mate. You okay? <laughs> How's it going? What channel is that on? Bus driver walking. Bus driver walking. Yeah, I'm a, I, I live here. I'm a bus driver, but do me uh, videos in my spare time. Well, and is this your stall, is it? Then, on the there you go. Stall. Come and get your handbags, your suitcases. Tear Prince Market. We we'll look after you now. Yeah. That's some uh, all the designs going on there. Something for everyone. Yeah, something for everyone. It is. You need for all the season, yeah. All season, yeah, mate. Brilliant. It's a bit of a hard, hard start to the season, but hopefully yeah. it'll pick up. As yeah, I'm on. sure it will. The weather's been rubbish, hasn't it? That's it. Yeah, hopefully we'll get a bit, yeah, bit of better weather I'll soon. It, I'll it, I'm going to give you a lookout now. Yeah, is make sure YouTube? you YouTube bus driver walking. Yeah. Bus driver Hit that walking. subscribe button. Yeah, man, I'll give you a subscribe. Cheers, pal. Nice one. See you later. Let's get you down, get yourselves down there guys. Let's sort you out if you're looking for uh, a bag. All these coats going on. Like I said at the beginning, you get everything on here. Lucky dips, two pound each, six for a tenner. Who knows what you're gonna get. Oh, it's feeling nice now with the sunshine coming out. Feeling a lot warmer. All your cookies. We got a Kinder Bueno, M&Ms, Smarties, Cabris. I just put two pounds on looking at it. Some 
something else to get your steps in walking around here. Is your butcher? Is she doing your barbecues on your uh, campsites? So there's all your wax melts, well these look good, so all your big brands in uh, wax melt form, three for a pound, they accept cards as well, see so a lot of stalls are these days, which is really handy, how many people carry cash around with them now? Yeah, so these are like your copies, your uh, big brand perfumes. Sports memorabilia stall there. The scarves, trophies, t shirts. So we're heading more into the car boot side of things now. And your costume jewelry, bracelets. Very nice. I do with doing a good boot sale myself. The garage is full, the loft's full. I did used to do a few booties years ago, now and again. The trouble was, we got rid of all our stuff and we took someone else's stuff home. As you do. I think Sunday is probably the busy day. Saturday and Sunday for the car boot. Um, yeah, normally Easter time, especially. It's usually around all these. When I'm walking now, it's usually full of car boot stuff. A little bit quieter today. All the kids' bikes there. Buggies. If you're desperate for a buggy while you're on all day, get yourself down. So I'll just uh, show you the size of the car park here. all the way down there to where we came in and right along 
one thing about this car park, um, I, don't, I don't park here anymore, I usually park down by um, Town Crossroads on the main road. You get here early, there's always space. Yeah, when there's been a good downpour, it does tend to flood a little bit, that car park. Um, looking at it now, to be fair, it doesn't look too bad. The amount of rain we've had looks pretty dry. So maybe they've been, they've been sorting that out over the winter. So we're just coming to the end of the market now. A little stroll, tweak it around, probably 30, 40, 30, between 30 and 45 minutes, I'd say. I don't know how many times you stop to look. But uh, yeah, it's, I love having a little mooch around here, to be honest. Morning. You okay? Well, if anybody else out there does like a nice mistake, go on, you will be the next day. Yeah, I'll put you on. Uh, little walk around the market done. Um, just got a little walk around the fairground, so what's new, so what's changed from last year. I think there's, like I say, I think there's some uh, new rides. So we'll check them out. Let's go. So it looks like they've, uh, they've extended this carpeted area as well from last year, which is, uh, makes it a bit more child friendly. So we'll have a little walk over here, check out what's, uh, what's going on this side. We've got all these slush mixing up. Let's have a look what flavours I've got. So, tropical fruit, Barbie slush, cola, vino slush, Red Bull, Prime. Don't know how much they are. We've got the same again on that side. We've got the small kiddies rides here on the left, Mickey Mouse. This is the runaway train. This is new this year. Not sure what it is to be honest. So it says around the front. Oh, there you go, snow slide. Oh, nice, okay, so you've got an inflatable, looks like it's uh, like, like a bed of air, yeah that's fun, kids will love that. There you go, are you brave enough? So this is new as well on the uh, on the right hand side here. We'll walk around this way. Just trying to avoid all the music. It's a uh, fun house. Well, that's new this year. Which I think is in the place of what was the uh, the big wheel last year. Carts just over there. There's a 
all your uh, hot dogs and burgers. I've been tempted over by the, uh, the smell of the food. Couldn't resist. There you go, nice uh, five hygiene rating. Can't get better than that. Is this uh, fucking Chinese stuff? It's my kind of stall. Smells gorgeous. The smell of your stall has tempted me over, I couldn't resist. So there's, uh, there's all your prices there. Very nice. Very nice, let's move on. What have we got here? Nutella House. Now oh guys, I can't tell you how much I love Nutella. I could eat it by the tub. You know, your big cookies again, popcorn, candy floss. Cookies, 3.50, three for the tenner. Only donuts. Got a chocolate fountain going on. Creams, two twenty, two fifty with a plate. Very nice, fuck a duck. I've said that a few times. <laughs> There's your go karts. When I was in my teens, whenever I used to go to the fairground, that's where all my money would go. I wasn't interested in anything else. I'd be on the go karts all day. The two car race at the moment, sure it'll get a lot busier later on. Yeah, that looks amazing at night. I say, I was driving home last night, all this was lit up. The tower itself lights up, and underneath the, uh, the cars, there's lights as well. It really did look cool. So this ride here looks, uh, looks fun as well. Again, there's probably more for the little ones inside. Um, so everything is credits. So there's no cash taken on any of the rides. It's all uh, on a card, I think, which you get from the ticket office. Load your, load your card up. And off you go. Magic Mouse. See, they're my kind of rides. Um, I like rides that are fun, not rides that terrify you. So it looks like you're just getting that ride going for the day. We need a little test. Okay, so we just crossed over from the fairground now, heading in towards the uh, town crossroads. But just wanted to show you what's been going on here. Uh, this site here was where the uh, caravan uh, showground was for uh, wind cups. Um, so yeah, to show you where it is, there's wind cups there. This is where all the caravan sales were about five or six weeks ago. Uh, work started on here, um, building what is going to be a miniature golf uh, adventure. I drive up and down this road uh, more or less every day 
So I've been watching this being built from scratch. I've got to say, it's really impressive how they do it. I've watched it step by step as I've been driving past. It looks amazing. It's going to be really good when it's finished. They've done a similar thing up on uh, Robin Hood Camp on Rill uh, Coast Road. You might have seen it. Uh, they've got a pirate theme golf course there. But uh, I think this is going to be uh, bigger and it looks much better to be honest. The theming is absolutely brilliant. So I'm not sure how far off it's going to... Uh, how long it is before they complete it. They'll be ready for the summer, I would expect. But yeah, it looks great. I'm going to see if I can go on there and film when it's finished. Um, it belongs to Lions. And, uh, Lions are letting me film on the uh, holiday camps this year, so I'm going to see if they'll let me go and do a little film on that. The filming's going to start just after Easter on the holiday camps. Um, Wind Cups will be one of the first in Abbeyford, both of them are here in Tawan. So yeah, I'll uh, go and do that one's first, seems quite local. Hey okay guys, so we've crossed back over the road now. Um, we want to look at some caravans. Let's go and have a dream. <laughs> wow, the prices. <laughs> It was always my dream to own a caravan over here in Tawan many years ago before I lived here. So uh, let's have a look at this one here. So it says 61,000, 61,500. Let's have a look. Very nice. What's this one? 2023 model. This one's a bit cheaper. 60. What's 68,000 this one? Down to 62,905. Pretty much the same as the other one. Very nice. Let's see, this one was 89,000. Now it's 84,000. Bargain. Yes. Beautiful, aren't they? Far cry from the old caravans that I used to stay in. There was just a smell of gas and burnt toast. As soon as you open the door, that's what you smell, and you knew you were on all day. So this is the uh, Lloyd's Caravans, there's a contact number if you're interested in any of the caravans. Let's have a look at this one, 46,000. Right, so we've crossed back over again. Let's have a little, uh, little look in the black cat. Because it's the law, you can't come to town and not go in the black cat. machines there going on. A bit of air hockey. Ten pin bowling. Two pound a player. 
Two pound coins. Get into your temping bowling. With all your grabbing machines. Pence ago, when I'm in a big dog. Kentucky Derby. If you know, you know. Very addictive game now. That has been there since I was about eight, nine years old. Great game. machines 20 pence to play five games for a pound well that is that's five twenty p's is a pound <laughs> okay guys there you go let's move on Harry's cafe this was all refurbished over the winter as well it was all ripped out so a new seat and put in Nice little seat there, there and there now. That's your price list. Right guys, let's crack on. More takeaways, pizza and kebab, jazzers. I think this is the calm before the storm. This is going to be absolutely even later on tomorrow, all over the weekend. Seagull. Food smells gorgeous in there. Only fresh baps, hot baps, breakfast baps, pies and pasties. It's been here for years, this place as well. Mini Don. Right, so we're going to take a little walk down Sandbank Road. So it's going on down here, head towards the beach. This classic. All four transit pickup. Love it. It's tidy. Enridge, what would that be? 1974, is it? Pretty tidy. It's going to nip across here. So we've got more parking here, guys. Um, Pay display car park. Your machine there. So if you can't get a space out on the main road, just around the lights there to get our park today. And yeah, this is another alternative. And there's usually always space in there. The 
a little gift shop here. Next door is the uh, Sandbank Bakery. You can't come to Tawan without going to Sandbank Bakery. Absolutely amazing uh, pies and pasties, cakes. They take card as well. We've also got a shop in Rill now. Um, yeah, so if you're up that way, you can uh, pop in there. Have a little walk up along the prom. With your pies and your cakes. More gift shops on this side as well. Cattle and Martin's Cafe, and that's new. I remember seeing that one last year. So you got your Sandy Bang in. And you got the Morton Arms pub, just on your right here. Plenty of outside seating, if the weather's good enough. You got more gift shops. You got all your rock and candy floss and everything else you can think of in these shops. Kebab. It's a good atmosphere down here of a night as well. So you've got uh, Nightly's Amusements down the bottom here. Yeah, it's really good. We used to stay on Edwards Camp a lot. And uh, we used to holiday here, which is just around the corner here. Uh, Abbeyford camp, um, that's one that I'll be filming. Coming up soon, just after Easter, that'll be like I say, that'll be one of the first. It's one site I've never been on. I've stayed on most sites in uh, town, but that's one that I haven't stayed on, so yeah. Nice to go and have a look. Fish and chips. Nice little chippy there. Let's go there all the time. Like these amusements. So we're just gonna head over the bridge, a little walk around like these fair. So what's going on there? Let's see if the tide's in. Fair. Just going to show you the uh, price list for the fairground. Turn the camera around. So it gives you the price in pounds and credits. <coughs> so I'm guessing you can pay cash. You can pay cash and uh, get credits as well. That's how it seems. Here's your uh, go-kart track. Here's your dodgems. Here's all your uh, burger prices.
buy all your uh, credits for your rides. You can check your balance on that little uh, machine there. There's mainly kiddies rides I think on this uh, on this fairground. So you got that ride there. The adults. There's your uh, fun house. Guys, so I'm gonna round the video off here. Um, I hope you enjoyed that little tour of uh, Tawan on this uh, Good Friday. Um, don't forget to hit that thumbs up for me. It really does help me out. And uh, hit the subscribe button if you're not already. Um, thanks for watching. Have a lovely Easter, and I'll see you in the next one, guys. Take care. Bye for now.